Hey guys, Mama Lauren Jane here, here with Rudy. And we are going to see the doctor today. I'm 41, 40 weeks and one day, two days. And we're gonna see if we hear any good news today. Hey miss, hey miss. Yeah? What's your name? What's your Marjorie. name? What's your name, girl? What's your name? What's your name? What's your name? Stop it. And can you guys tell that it's Rudy recording and not Larik? We're, we're in the Girl? <laughs> not the waiting room. In the exam room. They're going to check my cervix and see what's going on down there. Jaden has dropped. Like A mixtape. I was taking a shower this morning and I felt the em emptiness right down here. So that's a good sign. Um, hopefully my cervix is dilated or something. I don't know. Any news is good news. It's torture, right? It's torture. Yeah. So talk to the kid and say, come join us. I've been talking to him. We've both been talking to him. Well, welcome to parenting. They don't listen on the inside or the outside. <laughs> yeah, I just I just want him to come out. Yes. Well, so due dates are horrible. Personally, here, just sit back and take a peek. Personally, I hate due dates. You know why? A full-term pregnancy is defined as 37 weeks till 42 weeks. So there is a five-week window when it's okay to have a kid. We all think about that one day, but it really doesn't mean very much. As long as you're okay and the baby's okay, mm -hmm. rush. Your kid looks good, the flu is good, and that's a nice indication that the placenta is still working well. Yeah. Happy baby. He's She's all right. happy. He's very happy. Is it a boy? Yeah. yeah so boys are lazy. Boys don't want to come out. Boys are being lazy and stay inside. Look, look what you got inside. Indoor pool. I'm in, the, I'm in the water. I got the umbilical cord feeding me all the time. I'm at the buffet. I'm not coming out. <laughs> right? Yeah. It's annoying. But you know, you know whose fault this is, right? Who is that man over there? He got you pregnant. <laughs> <laughs> it's all your fault, but there, everything's good. So you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna wait. I'm gonna give you a hug, and you're gonna come back on Monday or Tuesday next week. Oh dear. Thanks. I have a lot of um, lightning crotch. Hmm. Lightning crotch. Mm -hmm. Hurts. Yeah, it hurts a lot. Yeah. So your pelvis, like your pelvis and my pelvis, is fused. Yours is not. Yours is changing shape. Oh. Let those legs go all the way to the side. I'm actually doing like a real pelvic thing. Totally uncomfortable. Oh. And your cervix is still backed by student liners, but it's real soft. Whoa, that was intense! <laughs> that was my lightning crotch. <laughs> <laughs> that was terrible! <laughs> okay. Okay, it's soft, so. Yeah. But I'm not dilated. It's hard to tell so far away. Like, I'd have to torture you to tell you that you're dilated. Oh. I'm not going to torture you. Because, you know, there's more to a pelvic exam than just dilation of the cervix. It's where is the baby's head, where is the cervix located? Like your cervix is still, it's still back a little bit. It's gotta come forward. Uh -huh. You're okay, and your kid's good. Yeah, good, that's, that's what we wanna hear. And, and you know, when your child's gonna join us, talk to the kid. And you can make yourself contract. You can rub your nipples, you can give yourself diarrhea, you can have intercourse, you will contract. But if the kid's not ready, you're just gonna contract and be crabby. You uh -huh. can do those tricks if you want. Okay. Or you can just go home and watch TV. So you're probably gonna do that. <laughs> Watch TV. Go on that Netflix something. Huh? Yeah. <laughs> Netflix and Hulu. There you go. So we just left the appointment. Um, no, nothing has changed really. He said my cervix is very soft, but he didn't give me any numbers or anything like that. And I have to come back on Tuesday at 11:15. But you're not. But Rudy and I, we don't want to come you're back. You're gonna be a mommy, son. Hopefully. Well, you're gonna be a mommy. To our yeah, son. <laughs> so we'll see what happens. Right now we're gonna go get pizza. Cause you remember what level we parked on? Yeah, B. Oh, <laughs> I'm glad you remembered because I've been a scavenger hunter. Yeah.